I'm Donovan Darius with this week's podcast of Donovan Darius Podcast, Life on Purpose. Oftentimes, people always wonder, what is the key to success of being more happier? They see people smiling all the time. You have some people who are sad all the time. They're wondering, listen, is that for me? How can I create a happier life? Well, I'm going to give you basically five little areas in which that I believe if you practice and you do, you can wind up living a more fulfilled life and a happier life. Number one thing I suggest is I want you to devote more time to your family and friends. Now, we know that every friend is not positive. We know that every family member is not positive. But I think if you spend some time, you'll realize what family and friends are more positive than others. Spending time around your family and friends just does something to you where you're giving to them, they're giving to you. Very simple thing that we can do. Number two, I want you to basically appreciate what you have. What I call practicing gratitude. That's where everything you have, instead of thinking about what you don't have, you say, you know what, I'm grateful that I woke up this morning. I'm grateful and I'm, and I'm, I'm blessed that I can talk to people today, that I can reach out, that I'm, may not be ha- I may not have everything I want, but I'm grateful for what I do have. And so by practicing gratitude, I realize when I do that, that my life just becomes even more fulfilled. Number three, I want you to basically maintain an optimistic mindset. Sure, some people look at life in a half glass, a glass half empty, but they're living looking at it from a half, a glass half full as well, where you can look at life and say, you know what, I, no matter what it looks like, I know I can come out of this. No matter what it seems like, I'm not the only person that dealt with this, and if it happened for them, it can happen for me. That's a mentality, and it's something that being more optimistic is going to help you be happier. And number four, just basically having a feeling and a sense of purpose. When you set goals, it gives you direction. Imagine a plane taking off from California and didn't set a goal. Well, that plane would never get to the destination. That plane would be just wandering around, and a lot of times that's what we do. When we don't set a goal, then we just wander around, and our life cannot be fulfilled. So by setting goals, I believe that that too can bring you to a life of purpose, and it can give you an opportunity to live your life and become more happier. And the fifth thing that I suggest in terms of living a life with a little, being more happier is basically living in the moment. A lot of times we're thinking about what we got to do tomorrow. We're doing to-do lists. But live life in the moment. Take a moment where just stop. Take a deep breath in. Realize how blessed you are just to be here. Everything may not be perfect, but you're here to make a difference one moment at a time. And so those are five quick things. Again, if you practice them, it's just like when I was playing with the Jaguars. When I practice backpedaling, when I practice tackling, when I practice going against, you know, Mark Brunel and Jimmy said, guess what? When it came game time, I got better because I practiced. So for you to live a happier life, remember, here's our five things again. Devote time with family and friends. Appreciate, you know, yourself. Practice gratitude. Maintain an optimistic mindset. Have a feeling of sense of purpose by setting goals and live life in the moment. And so I hope that helped you. I hope the next time I talk to you, you're living a happier life. I'm Donovan Darius with uh, Life on Purpose. You be blessed.